he knows well, you might be able to get through to him. And I wouldn't ask you to do it if it weren't for the baby. I wanted to check on you. Make sure you're okay. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katya. Sarita. No peace. No rest. The punches just keep coming. I know it's hard. For everyone. But things will get better. Why the hell could Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That's not true. You help me. All the time. I need you. Hmm. I've seen you take care of yourself more than any three adults put together. But, uh, thanks for saying that. Tell me yet, anyway. Don't be stupid. It could be infected. Well? Oh shit! Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. And that means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. This place doesn't seem safe for a baby being born. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. That all sound right? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful.
Oh, hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Did you find anything out here? Huh? Oh, uh, not yet. I hadn't really started looking until you showed up. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? If it's locked, maybe there's still food. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Find anything? No, not even trash. How can I help? If you can find anything to help me get this open faster, that'd be great. Take a look around. You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. Oh. They fill them with cement, so they're safe. I guess it's broken. Okay. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around. Why is he coming up here? No idea. 
But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. I'll distract him so you can sneak up behind him. Good call. Shh. Hide now. Hey. Don't try to run. We have you surrounded. Do you understand me? Yes. I am Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to we you. We just need to make sure you're not a threat. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. This medicine is all she has. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you you take my sister's medicine. You are worried. Hey, need we've it. got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it, Clementine. We need people that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. I'm sorry, Arvo. We need these. You will fish. You hadn't done this. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Is it safe to let him go? Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Taking some stupid kid stuff, like a bandit. Go bring those meds to the others and bring everybody back here. I'm gonna get this place opened, and we need to get moved in ASAP. Hey, any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. The deck might be a safe place we can stay tonight, where Rebecca could have the baby. At least, if we can't find something better. I guess that's something. I should check it out. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I 
I'm never quite sure if she just done like people, or just plain out done like me. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep, that's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know. But when I look at Kenny now, he just—he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. Are you any better? Is anyone? Whoa, whoa, hold on. I, I didn't mean. I just want to survive, and that means picking the right sides. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will. Uh, I'll see you back there. Supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny? What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine, what'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer. It's coming so much faster than I thought. There's a room up there that might be good for when Rebecca has the baby. Jane's trying to get it open. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared, and it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby. Giving himself up to Carver like that. It was to try to keep you and the baby safe. Yeah, I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? We'll all help you keep the baby safe. Oh yeah, you're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ah, oh shit. I got this. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust them, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on them. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Are you okay, Kenny? Sure. Why wouldn't I be? Jane and I found some medicine. Is it safe for Rebecca to take? Mm. Well, should make her more comfortable anyway. Clementine, you are my favorite person in the entire world.
Hey, Clem. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? Well, it's just a, a feeling. I know Jane seems like she doesn't care about anyone, but I trust her. She's trying to get the place we found ready for Rebecca. Well, that's good. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty-handed. What? I just want to help. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I watch this side. You watch the other. Deal. Jane said these don't work anymore. Nah, they're just for show. Be handy though. Also, really loud. Good point. You think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with. I sure hope we can find something to take back. Me too. There have sure been some animals through here. Watch where you step. Empty. Any luck? No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Souvenirs, huh? Looking for a keychain with your name on it? No. Why would I want a keychain? I don't even have any keys. Ah, oh, good point. I tell you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the world the way it is now. The way things are now, you're in a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Lee would have loved this place. Do you see anything good? Not so far, but let's give the place a good going over. I can't believe Rebecca's about to have a baby. Kind of blows your mind, doesn't it? I guess. anything yet? Not really.
Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's going to get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. And someone could use it. Maybe I could give it to Rebecca. That's a good idea. I'm sure she'll really appreciate it. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. You finally opened your eyes about Carver and what a bad person he was. That's something. Yeah. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh, we can't put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Over here. Water. Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, maybe... Are you sure you can't get it open? Okay, no, that's all right. Maybe I can just reach through to the lock. That happened. You okay, Bonnie? It's just a bump. I'm gonna be all right. Christ, that would have been a stupid way to die. Let me see your arm. No, I... I didn't get bit, just old scars. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Hey, I got this. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, it's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. 
Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. We'll make a plan. Everyone will have enough. I hope so. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stick close. I just walked on in like I'd owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I am starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Over here! the walkers out there. I'm even hungrier than I was before. How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well, that sucks. Yeah. Yeah, it does. There's a few folks that could use a hot meal. It's probably for the better. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. I could do this all day. No! No! Shit! Shit! Oh, God! Breathe no! like I told you. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. Shit! Walkers! How'd they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke! Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. Clementine, where's the place you and Jane found? I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. Oh, God, there's so many. Mike, help Kenny. On it. I've felt in a long time. I almost forgot what... Clementine! J Jesus, Clem, it's just not... Uh... What's going on? Well, uh... I mean... In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. Luke, shut up. I didn't... No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right over Shit. here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. Uh, we should... You want to uh. help? Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. Shit, that's a lot of... We need everyone out here. What do I do? 
whatever you can, Claire. I'm going outside. I'll help hold them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come! Here. We can't let them up here.
Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's the perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Do you want to hold them? Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Oh, about two years ago. I'm fine. Plus, somebody's got to watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. You never forget that smell. to you two. You know the score. You're a smart kid. But I thought you believed in me. I do. But give it enough time and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. But when push comes to shove... Can... can I go with you? No, you can't. That's not how this works. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Thanks. Yeah. I, um... Uh, I gotta go. be asleep by now. You okay? It's nothing, Luke. Don't worry about it. Okay. Just checking in with you. The temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore, see if we can find some place to scavenge. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? 
Luke, of all the childish bullshit, childish. God damn it, Kenny, you know what, just lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two can roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? You guys are both acting like jerks. All you guys do is fight. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer. And Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit Kenny, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. Whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa. What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days at, at the least. We've got that baby formula. That won't help the rest of us. Now what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Kenny's right. We should leave in the morning. Rebecca is not in any condition to travel. I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to risk it. <sighs> okay, fine, if that's what you want. Look, we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, Bex? It's gonna be all right. Exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This looked like someplace warm to you? We could still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. Kenny's right. We have to keep going. Yeah, I guess. Of course, I'd expect you to say that, seeing as how you agreed with him last night. Uh, uh, oh. Oh, here. There's a place to sit. Rebecca, let me take the baby. Oh, he's okay. I've got him. No, you rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being Shh. weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. And not just right now. Kenny knows what he's doing. He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. Hello? What is this? Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? 
He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please? He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. <laughs> All right. Hello. Your name is Clementine. Yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. What do you need? How can we help? I need, uh, uh things for bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Fuck! Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что мы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? Чтобы у них не было. Может быть, у них есть патроны. What's so funny? Why did they laugh? I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a link. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What the hell? Why get excited? No, you aren't taking anything from us. They're not telling me to ask. So what is Josh? I wish we could have met differently, Clementine. But this is how it has to be. This could be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass! We have a baby! You have a baby with you? We need a child with a baby! Is it this guy who is so good to you? Just get the fuck off! You have a lot of guns! Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it! I'll do it! Drop it! Drop it! Don't fucking... Don't move! I said, don't move! Do you want to go yet? Everybody, 